Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Natalie here with another video. Today is the Big 12 championship and I'm gonna be vlogging all of it. I go to Oklahoma State and it's OSC versus Baylor, so of course I had to come down to my hometown. Well, it's in DFW, it's at AT&T Stadium. I'm just getting ready right now with my little Emily. She's back there. <laughs> hey! I'm doing my makeup and yeah, I'm gonna vlog the whole day. I am so excited. It's gonna be fun. Pokes are gonna kill them. They better. We're gonna smoke them, yeah. It's an 11 a.m. game, so it's a little bit early for my liking. I don't really love 11 a.m. games, but that's okay. Um. <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> I'm excited. There's a bunch of my sorority sisters who've came down and my parents are going with me so it'll be really fun and I can't wait to be Baylor. So we're making game predictions. What's your prediction, Em? My prediction is that we win by a field goal, three points. Three points? That's what I thought it, we were going to win by at Bedlam. What did, how much did we win by Bedlam? Four. Oh, so yeah, I think we'll win by three points and if I'm correct, everyone knows me. I think we're going to win by 8 because... I don't think we're going to win by 10 like last time. But granted, I haven't seen Baylor play at all this year because I didn't... I wasn't able to go to the Baylor game. But we won by 10. So that just makes me think that we'll be fine, you know? But like, didn't TCU beat Baylor? Yeah, because Katie was saying that last night. Yeah, so like that's why I'm like, what? So confused. But it'll be fun. Um, Of course, we're in the nosebleeds, you know cheap tickets because they were so crazy expensive so you guys are going to be getting like top of the line views up there <laughs> oh i have to do my orange makeup we're gonna do my orange eyeshadow because yes. this is probably the last time this year that i'll be doing it how tragic i mean i don't know how many games we're gonna go to but i probably won't go to bowl games i don't know what i'm wearing yet today um, I was thinking, I wanted to wear a dress, but it's 66 degrees, and I feel like it would be really cold, but it's also supposed to warm up. And but the, the stadium's also indoors. Oh, that's true. So I think I'm going to wear my hair in, like, a low pony. Yeah? Or should I wear high pony? I don't know. What do you want to do? I think a high pony would be cute. You always wear high ponies. It's just, like, there's one hairstyle that is, like, not just normal, like, down. It's a high pony. That's true. And, like, I never wear my hair up. You know I, I mean? know you never do. You know what's funny? The reason that I don't wear my hair up ever is because whenever I was in elementary school, I used to wear my hair up in a ponytail every day. Like I thought I was a tomboy girl, like one of those. I wore like <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> the athletic clothes and stuff. Like I was so different. And my mom, her, I don't know if it was my mom or if it was just some kid in class, but someone said to me like. Why do you always wear your hair in ponytails? Like, you never wear it down. And I, like, it made me so self-conscious that I stopped. So, blog. This is how I do my mascara. I get it all over my eyes. <laughs> and then she wipes it off with a Q-tip. Sorry. Yeah. Do we like Emily's belly button ring? <laughs> it's new. <laughs> Very cute. Oh, everyone, this is um, the sweatshirt that Natalie got me for my birthday. Happy hour, and then I'll show you the sleeve. I feel like a blogger now. <laughs> it says, and it, it yeah, say? it says, take the time to do the things that make your soul happy. And then the hood here has a happy hour, like the back. It's um from that it's brand. Real cute. It's from the brand Luda oh. Closet that I talked about in my gift guide video. Um, I got that one from there too. If you want to go watch that video. <laughs> Thanks for the hype up, Emily. Well, I know that they do that. <laughs> I need to get my outfit on. I'll be back. All right, here's my outfit. Excuse the messy room of girls that are crashing here over the weekend. But this is what I'm wearing. I have on Emily's little leather shorts. Here, let me turn it so you can see better. I have on Emily's little leather Short, super cute, a little one shoulder orange top that I got from Amazon actually. And then I have my favorite boots ever, my OSU cowgirl boots. Woohoo! Gonna be so fun. Go pokes. 
I'm doing Emily's makeup. Okay, I'm switching over to my phone because I'm not gonna bring my camera into the game. So, sorry for the quality, but it's gonna be fun. Well, finally out of the car. Game is starting. We're trying to rush inside. It's about 11.20. Game started at like 11, so we're getting there. It's a bit chilly, it's um, cloudy today, but I think after this, we're gonna go to Texas Live, so that'll be fun. And I'll show you guys that. Oh my God. Um, woo! Woo woo! Welcome to the 2021 Big 12 Football Championship. Go Pokes. We're here at the beautiful Jerry World. Woohoo! So yeah, the game's already on. Texas Live now. We're gonna eat our sorrows away. We're at Texas Live. Madeline is here. Number one. Stick up. Stop. Don't do it. <laughs> Alright guys, hi. <laughs> I am back home on my camera. I fell asleep in the car. I was so tired. Um, but <laughs> we went to Texas Live and I just wanted to tell you. So there was a live band and Emily was like, Natalie, oh my gosh, you should go sing with them. You should go sing with them. And I was like, no. She's like, if I went up and talked to one of them, would you? And I was like, yeah. So she went up to one of the like band members and they, I almost sung on stage at Texas Live. It was actually pretty funny. Um, but I ended up not because we had to go home and they weren't going to be back until like 10 or 11 tonight. Um, but I just thought that was really funny. I had a really fun day today. I am literally so exhausted. I'm just going to get on my computer and start editing right now. Glad I got to vlog this experience. I'm very upset that OSU didn't win. Obviously, I had a wrong prediction, but it was still all fun. Fun and games, and yeah. 